What's up guys, today I'm going to be playing Crypto the Necrodancer for the Nintendo Switch. I'm playing as the Bard because this game can be pretty tricky. I'm going to try and clear this here. So, you never played this game before. It's kind of an RPG where you gotta move at the right time. Normally you do it to the beat. And you get money for beating them up. Most guys got a bit of a technique to them so you know what to do. It's a bit challenging though. And you want to get those diamonds. Boom. Everything moves on different speeds. You'll see many different enemies. And you just gotta learn the correct way to do their attacks. Oh. And not land in the line of fire. This guy's pretty cool. Don't want any of those. Or maybe the bag. Oh. Did a gold? And the nice thing about the bard is it gives you a bit of recovery. Ooh, nice. I like the rap here. There's different weapons too. Like you've seen there. Oh. And I got him. Nice. This weapon was the only reason I got him. Oh, I can't break that. On to the next level. Oh, this weapon is good. Long range. Powerful. And it does double damage at long range. There's so much fun stuff to this game. Oh. Monkey. Monkey. Oops. Nice. Another diamond. There's a lot of different perks you can get. Oops. Oh, of course. And I died. That was a good run. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Wasn't the best run, but just want to try it out. Got killed by a Dark Minotaur. 147 coins. So, this game's pretty fun. Hope you guys enjoyed watching that. If you did, please hit that subscribe button below. I'll see you guys next time.